All right, all right, all right. We have some beats for you today. And thank you for everyone that sent the beats in. I'm um, just going to start playing them and I'll talk over the beats. Totally disrespect to you guys. No, I'm just joking, but um, I'll definitely talk a little bit about the beats and uh, the things that, uh, you know, caught my attention. And uh, and every, everything's kind of scattered throughout. There are no good or bad beats. Uh, certain things on certain beats that don't have a very good mix, but the the way that they chopped the sample, I thought it was really really interesting. So you, you'll you'll hear a lot of that throughout the uh, throughout the next hour. Anyway, I'll just start and play these beats for you guys. Okay, let's go. Let's get into some funky bass. Yeah. By the way, the name of the artist is always here on the side, so you can guys go and check them out. That's one of the things that I found is that there were a lot of great beats in here, but like like fifty percent of them were really not the mix wasn't really there, you know. That's one of the issues that I found. Anyway, let's keep going. Samples in here. Thank you. 
yeah, yeah. Chop on this. Again, another great mixing. Love, love the way they chop the samples as well. some creative process um, I thought it was really dope that it actually made a very interesting loop but um, he didn't drop those nature sounds on top and I think he's just that's so rich and I think that's one of the things about lo-fi is that you can just transform the beat into whatever you want it to be I'm mean, really happy that you guys sent in those beats, man. And as I was talking before, you know, I think one of the things that I found is that most, uh, there were a lot of the beats were lacking on the mix. And I think most of the time it's just just about you finding the right drums and the right snares and just, you know, because that's half of the beat, you know. Once you get your drums right, that's really all you need, you know. That's that's a big part of of making a great beat is having the right drums on it. Real chill vibes right here. enjoy this one If you have a good drum loop, then the sample is not that important. But if you have a bad drum loop, then you need to have a really great sample to make up for it. Just the repetitiveness of this sample. It's really well done. Woo! That sample. Nice. Chop on this
really nice flip nice flip nice drums as well Check out that set. This next guy is gonna use that same sample. Really love the way that he used it though. Listen. So it's really great to see how everyone kind of uses it a different way. I wish that it could have used a little bit more velocity so the, the sample would fade out. But it was really a really nice use of that cut. just the way that the moods man so many different moods that people take from it happy vibes
really speedy. Speedy Gonzalez. Same sample. Different beat though. Woo! You know this is my vibe. Think sometimes. Yeah, yeah. Great groove, great swing. And I like what you did with the bass as well. flip that I love the most. me back to DJ Crush. Chop on this. Let's keep going. This is back in the day. 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 Great use of no repeat. Drums are knocking on this one.
had a lot of these vibes, but I love these these type of beats. You don't need you don't need a beat for this. into the SP404 world. out this instrumental just simple chops that's all you need though I feel sometimes people just stumble on themselves by like, trying to make like these crazy cuts when you don't need to do that. Like you just, if you make a simple cut and let it loop well enough, then it, that, that's all you need. But some people try to make like super, like high end tech collage that just doesn't flow good, you know. So that's just one of my opinion. All good instrumentals right here.
Timeless Vibes. Shout out to the Jazz Room. chilled vibes I dig this type of stuff and I'm happy that you know, I got people from different machines to join in, you know, Machine Dudes, uh, FL Studio, Ableton, whatever, you name it. And that's great to see, you know. Great kick, I like the kick, man. Nice flip, too. Changing it up. How you guys feeling? I hope you guys enjoying the uh, the hour here with the instrumentals. good variety of samples. It took a little bit from everything. I like that. You hear you hear a lot of the same sample all the time. Great drums. I like that sample they used. I like what you did with the guitar, dude. Let's go. into that that rhythm that we had before
Hey, I'm not a DJ. <laughs> I know, I know some of these uh, crossovers are not really good. this I hope you guys enjoy the half an hour now the beats that you guys are listening are some of the beats that really caught my attention Letting the sample drop. Good one, my brother. And this is where I leave you at. Just wanted to stay with you for the first half an hour, but I'm gonna go, I'm gonna let, let you guys chill to the beats. So we have a lot of good stuff coming in the next half an hour, but uh, you know I wanna I wanna first of all thank you all for sending in those instrumentals. I'm gonna give you two extra links. I'm gonna start doing this like every two weeks. So I'm gonna leave you links for two songs. Now you're gonna have two songs to chop. Okay, and uh, I hope you guys can, just so we can have a bit more variety in samples, next time I play this set for you guys, we're going to have uh, different beats instead of always listening to the same sample. So I want to see how you guys flip it. If you guys want to try it out, the links are down below. You have one week to make the beat, so everything that comes after that, I'm not going to use. You know, a lot of you guys sent the beat after Wednesday, last Wednesday, uh, hoping that I was going to play it, but actually I didn't. So make sure you send them up to next Wednesday, okay? If you guys want me to play your beats on the video, and it's going to come out in two weeks, all right? So that's it. Thank you so much for being here on this half an hour with me. I hope you guys enjoy this time. I hope this kind of video works. If it, if it works, I'm going to keep on making more of these. So if you like this type of beat video, share it, and so everyone can see it, and I can keep on making these videos as well i had a really good time it was great listening i actually learned from you guys as well there are a few things in here that i i kept my ear open and see how you guys flip the sample so it's great to listen to it as well i learned a lot of stuff from listening to your songs and uh, to your instrumentals uh anyway uh links are down below for the next challenge listen this is not a contest some of you were saying like you wanted to enter the contest there's no contest this is just us chilling to the music that we make no one is the winner we just want to listen to beats and see how other people flip those samples uh, again the new name for the um the new name for the video is Chop On This because I had some issues with the other name. There's another guy that is using it. It's called I Make Beats. You guys can go and check his channel out. Links are down below for you guys to go and grab the next song for you to chop and you got a week to send it over to my email. The information is all down in the description. I hope you guys really enjoy this. I'm really happy with the beats that you guys sent in. I'm hoping to see more of this. Props to all the new dudes that are making beats and that sent in those beats, even though they're really trying it out, trying to see uh, how to make beats. 
uh, I noticed that a lot of you are newcomers, are beginners to beat making, and it takes a lot of guts to send in an instrumental like you guys did. So I'm really happy that you did. Props to you dudes. Uh, and uh, that's it. Let's keep on hearing some instrumentals and uh, I'll see you on the next video, guys. Thank you so much. Peace.